Hello everyone, welcome to The Logical Fallacy. My name is Sean and welcome to another special video. Today we're going to be playing through a game called Limpo? Uh, maybe it's Limbo. Uh, we're going to... Uh, lim lim I'm going to guess it's Limpo, uh, but maybe it is Limbo. We'll, we'll see, we'll see. Anyways, it's, it's probably not your average horror game. We'll see about that, but in it, you will get a little lost. And there's a big emphasis on exploring and figuring out things out your, ourself. Expect no hand-holding. I appreciate that. I personally don't like games that, you know, tell you exactly where to go. Actually, I love those types of games. Uh, this is going to be a bit difficult. Um, the dark atmosphere of the sea. Okay. We get, we, we get it. We get it. Uh, okay, interesting. This looks pretty environmentally pretty good. It's an Unreal Engine game. Which I only am pointing out because I like Unreal Engine. Okay. Starting a new game will overwrite an existing save. Oh no! My save file. No, I'm joking. I don't have a save file. I'm really excited about this. This actually looks pretty cool. The evil principle. Offspring of demons. Oh. So there's some lore here. Same as Hisu and Peru. I'm not quite sure what those who those are. Do a love spell mid time and follow to a maze where love and men turn hollow. Only a few can escape others. Fade. Sounds like it's based on a poem. We'll see. Patience. Oh. This looks very cinematic. Really hear anything have you ever got lost in the woods Even yes for a while like at first you're in a place where you've been a hundred times you know where you're coming from and you know where you're heading you can't even imagine getting lost in here hey yeah, this is a bit different from what mind. i typically get but then you see something we get voiceover i've never had that in a horror game. a good mushroom spot you take a couple steps off the path. You take a photo or pick up the mushrooms. And when you turn back, everything looks different. Your heart skips a beat. Ooh. What if you can't find your way back to the right path? Of course, this usually lasts only a minute. And you're back on track in no time. But sometimes it can take a while. And sometimes... You get truly lost. Ooh. That's when you call someone and they send rescue people to get you. What if they can't find you? What if you are so lost? It's impossible for them to find you. Do you believe in fantasy worlds? I didn't either. Until I found myself in one. This looks really neat. My headphones, these aren't the ones I typically use. This, These are crap. Uh, I couldn't find my other ones, so I couldn't hear that really too well. But hopefully you guys could hear that. I got the general gist. It's an interesting concept about being lost in the woods. And it generally is a pretty terrifying concept. Uh, but obviously there's going to be some added elements. The night started out as any night. Oh. I was the last to leave the office. Okay, this is like legitimate. You know, I don't really see this level of qual. Well, that mouse is looking a little, a little weird right there. Okay, they're just they're just fancy, you know. Yeah. Wait, he's also the jump button, but it's also the interact button. I'm just like, ah, that's all right. Okay, is there anything we need to get? Dark corners. Now, this is just a demo for this game. Unfortunately, this isn't the full game. It does look, however... Seems like a bit of a bug. I can't get through here. What? Oh, it was already open. Press Q to toggle 
UI elements, you can see your health and current objective. Okay. What a week. That is, that is for sure. This week has been pretty rough. But it's been alright. Oh, interesting. <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Uh it's the classic, you jump, you get frozen. Oh, no, we're good. Oh, gosh. I just realized I don't have to jump. And it is interact. It is like you can basically interact, it seems like, with any button. Okay, a black cup with a picture of a pear on it. Not much to it. Interesting. Pretty cool. Aw. You can interact with a lot of stuff. Jim is a cleaning enthusiast. That's great. I mean, this looks legitimately like it's trying to be a quality story game. Horror game. So I'm actually rather excited about this. You get, you don't really get to, it doesn't seem like you get too many titles. Uh, we did, we, they've didn't been getting more frequent for me at least. Um, so just like generally everybody has the same coffee cup. Hello? Okay. The sensitivity level is absolutely ridiculous. Bring that down. Or maybe up. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll try it. Nope, that's, that's the, that's the definitely the wrong way. Let's bring that all the way up. <laughs> Probably gonna regret that. We'll see. Yes. Okay, that's that's extremely better. Extremely better. I don't think that's grammatically accurate. Interesting. Honey dog with the name Elizabeth written on the bottom. Oh, I took it. Nice. So, so it's a collectible. What's that? Okay, is there anything else? Am I missing anything? Five years. Thank you. Paul. Okay, so our name is Paul. We've been here for five years. Now we're gonna go get lost in the woods. Sounds very fun. Some classic Unreal Engine assets right here. Love it. I do love the, um, the added cinematic scene. That was actually really, really nice. Um, what is... What is that? Or to take up your lighter. Strange... Uh, oh, five. I wonder what that means. Oh. Interesting. Why are we driving a car? The light isn't really doing much. I don't like this cinematic, though. And just like that, I was lost. Oh, wait a second. Oh, that's cool. That's cool right there. Because I don't think we can go back to the building, can we? It really bugged me that I couldn't find the office. Yeah. I was certain I hadn't wandered that far. And the forest <laughs> around me didn't seem familiar at all. Resisting the dark forces of the forest I is tiring and slowing. I soon started to realize that I wasn't just simply lost. I was in a whole other place. Different climbing ladder. Okay. So this is a bit of a uh, exploratory game, so you can like kind of explore, which I really enjoy. So like, the path is apparently not. Okay. There's a ladder right here. So I need apparently though something to like I guess break the glass with. So I will be able to go down there eventually. Soul residue. Okay, I'm gonna be collecting that. Oh wait, hold on. That kind of look creepy, though. I don't think this is the right way. 
When snakes have their trails in the spring, they hold these stones in their mouths. If loaded with snake blood, the stone can give you back your strength. Filling the stone consumes soul residue. Press one quick heal. Okay. Can I take it? Okay, there we go. Oh gosh. Not enough soul residue. Okay. So let me go back. Because uh, I want to go kind of down the path that kind of was, even though it says it wasn't holding my hand, I doubt it would have us first going down the way, like, it's cool that I had that, though, and this is definitely very well made. Wait, did this change? This did not. Okay, so there is some, like, modern day, I would say, like, equipment. What is that? One soul. Okay, that is the soul residue. That makes sense. So I can light them. Find a way to the office. I have to find my way back. Uh, even though it doesn't feel like I can really do that quite yet. I'm going to have to fight something, so I'm going to need a weapon. This is really cool. Okay, there's something in the distance over here. There isn't really like a set path though. There are some lights. Okay, there's that thing. Five. Okay, nice. So they give that gives you way more. They gathered here to pray, hoping it would help them, but it did not, as they themselves were the prey. Ooh, that's a good play on words. Okay, so there's like an interesting... Okay, here's the main path. Wait, what's that over there? Use three soul residue as fuel. Oh, cool. Stop getting tired. Click the lantern the fire was save. comforting. It was hard to continue, but I knew I had to. Okay, so I saved it. Okay, I saved my game. That's really cool. Gosh, this is so cool. I love this. This honestly, I feel like there's actually been some really cool quality games recently. I'm not really running, though. wonder if that's because of stamina. Ah, I'm kind of running. I do like the open world kind of aesthetic. A lot of places to go. Oh. Elijah's old stroller. But how? Wait, what? Who's Elijah? Elijah had the same teddy when he was little. You can browse your items. Uh, is it one? Or I? Okay, here we go. We have a dog. And that. It's kind of creepy. Okay. There's something up here. I'm not sure what's going to attack us quite yet. But generally, I think that we're probably going to get attacked. Going back that way. Let's keep going, though. This is only a demo. I might be able to use it. I wonder, though, it does inventory slow us down. It is quite possible. I do like the landscaping, and this is like, gosh, look at that moon, that moon is stunning.
This generally is like a really cool aesthetic though. Seems to be... Can we climb up there? Hey, okay, there's another thing right here. Oh, did this loop us? Oh, I think it did. Wait, how? I think we, uh, Serpent's Trial has... Can we use something? Interesting. So it did loop us, though. At least I'm pretty sure. Unless this is a bigger map, uh, but I think that this generally did kind of, like, lead us around. Which is pretty cool. Yeah, it definitely did. Okay. That's good to know. That looks pretty creepy, though. What is that? It's just a log, they said. Go so onward. Oh, this definitely seems like the way. The shell. It's not right there. Okay, there's something right here. Okay, so we'll have forming. Puzzle. I gotta figure this out. Okay, what is this? Important. Always remember to lower the first step after using them. We don't want any creatures getting to the upper controls. Okay. That's gonna raise. Is that gonna raise all of them? Not quite. It's along that one. Okay. I think that generally did it. To raise enough of them so I can get over. Okay. I just need to raise a little bit more apparently. That should be... Yeah, that's not what Hmm. I'm not sure... What were that one first? Gonna lower those. Wait a second. Maybe I have to lower these. I just need to raise enough of them so I can get over. I know. Oh wait, hold on. Oh, I see. Okay, the elevator step is broken. Thanks for fixing things, George. <laughs> so I rigged one of these steps to function as a backup. Just use the usual lever to control the platform and then use the backup here. Let's hope this is only a very temporary solution. Sorry, once again, for the inconvenience. So there seems to be, like, basically kind of like a... 
Alright, so that, that other puzzle was completely unnecessary for right now. Or was it? Hold on. There's something here I need? Maybe not right now. Maybe I can platform. Nope. That is called nope in game design. As far as jumping on random things and hoping they don't glitch out. Okay, so it doesn't seem... Uh, no. Yeah, I don't think that... Well, we don't really need... That one doesn't seem... Let's try something. There must be something to this. Okay. All of them... This is a puzzle. Oh. It seems to have done it. I think we can get across now. Well, once we go over here and that again. Okay, we should though. Yeah. No, we should be able to get across though. There's no reason unless there's just a wall right there. Might be. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Why do I need to do that? That must be some for something a little bit later. Cannot jump apparently. So for some reason that chasm's a bit too far. I wonder though. That does those two, that raises that one up. That lowers those. It's gonna raise those back up. Raises that up. Okay, so that gets us to there. And it's the same one every time, so what's the... We should be able to, like, jump through one. It didn't say... It said that it wouldn't help us, so, you know. Maybe we should explore some more, but I really think that we can get up here. We just can't get up there then. It's gonna lead. Oh, maybe. Oh, it leads us to that button right there. Something. Let's just go see what this is. Out. Go comfy. Get comfy. There's no go getting back. We are all here for good. Stuck until Limpo has eaten all. The Limpo is the monster. Sorry if I'm being bleak, but that's just how it is. One thing you can make do is prolong your being. There's supposed to be a small bell here somewhere can help you avoid things. Alright. 
it feels like this is what we're supposed to be doing. We have everything except for this small step. We need to raise one of these. There's no way I'm like... Let's try this again. Okay. That just leads the mold. Put it down. that down. See, every single one of them is up except for that one. Except for that one. What did this note say again? Oh, it's gone. need to raise enough of them so I can get over. So I don't need to raise all of them. I should be able to, so I should be able to jump on some of them. That's definitely not the right one. It said just raise the first one. Maybe I can run and jump, can I? Environmentally, this is really cool. There we go. Are you freaking kidding? I'm just gonna die of fall damage. Wait, what? Oh. Wait, hold on. Uh oh. Bug. I think maybe I was cut. Okay, there's something with the textures. That's fine. I should be fine. Now that I have it. Hey. No! You can't get me. Okay, this thing is like glitching out for whatever reason. I think it looked like almost like a cutscene. Collision, this is still in demo phase. So they're still working on the collision physics. Which, hey, is alright. I just want to get up here, get the thing I need. And I think by now, in the demo. Because I feel like that's a good bit. It's going to take forever. Yeah, the physics, they're still working on the physics. Which is, you know, it's a work in progress. We're not, we never gonna judge a demo. Even if a game is free, there's no reason to really critique it. Okay, we are finally here. This took so freaking long. Okay, what are we supposed to do now?
This is just a light. Oh, maybe it was just the lever. Did that do something? Oh, crap. Don't... No, did I really just die by fall damage? Did I restart completely? Am I dead? Is this heaven? This room... I don't remember much of my first time in Limbo, but I think limbo? it was pretty empty Not limbo. And bright as hell. Wait. Oh, I see. This room is a work in progress. Click the bear to advance. Okay. Okay, so they're still working on the other stuff. Oh. That's rather creepy. Wait, what? Oh, I must have advanced. Oh, I understand now. Okay. Well, I'm actually glad I died. Look at that. So that is what those are for. Then... This is pretty. Game saved. Okay. Was that kind of telling me where I was supposed to go? I'm in a different area. Um, maybe it was a good thing I died then. Wait, is that a house? Really? A door. And there seems to be two objects missing. Okay, interesting. There's no suitable items in inventory. So I'm looking for those. Not see this house. How far did I travel? I wonder. That is an interesting glitch. I swear the light only made some twinkling noise, but somehow I understood it perfectly. Hmm. Interesting. Let's go to this. Does someone live here? The cabin. Noise. Noses, right finger, eyes. A code. Ah, man. So this is where the adventure really begins, I see. So I need a code. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. Wait, 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 just a second. I think I figured it out. Go to inventory. Documents. Oh, picture of family. Bruh. A reminder. Elevator. Note. Noses, right fingers, eyes. So there's two codes. Or, there, no, there's three numbers, and we got these three words right here. Um, it could be as simple as something like counting the letters, noses, so that's five, but that's 12, so that doesn't work. Right fingers, so you have one nose, your right fingers, right fingers. How many right fingers do you have? Well, right fingers is five, so it's one, five, two. One. Look at that. I am so smart.
sleep here, yes? These shoes look kind of like the... Alright. Read. The time of day doesn't seem to change here. I have decided to start counting my sleeps. I don't know how many times I have slept before I started counting. Maybe nine? It's now sleep two, officially. Sleep three. I met a man. He doesn't talk much, but seems to have been here a long time. I gathered that he was once a sailor of some kind. At first, I was happy to see someone, but he can't help me. He said there's only one way out. He wouldn't say what it is. He has a nice dog. <laughs> the dog stole my compass. The sailor didn't care when I told him. Fortunately, the place is small. I can't quite easily find my way around without it, stupid dog. Day sleep 31. I don't know if the entity is just toying with me, but I found some pretty convincing looking lab equipment in a cave south of here. Could be that someone knows about this place and has even managed to study it. That would mean that they're most likely the safe way out too. Could something like this have a remained Oh Could something like this have remained a secret? I'll investigate further tomorrow. Looks sleep thirty two looks like there has been has not been anyone in sight for some time. Sleep 33. Very, very nice observation right there. I found a second metal ear that it looks like it could fit into a stone door outside. It was in the cave. I'm going to use it now in the case it's one of those disappearing things. The code to the door was written on the document. 4499. Okay. You better stop. An elderly wanderer came and knocked on the door last night. His jaw was covered by a large white beard, and his eyes by the hood of his cape. He smelled like conifers, liquor, and honey. I didn't speak much. I offer my mother's protection. After that, he pushed me aside and stepped in and waved his hand a few times next to a wall, chanting the words that made no sense to me. But he might be on drugs, so I didn't try to stop him. These people can do anything if provoked. After maybe a minute, he was done and left without a word. This morning, a glowing picture had appeared on the wall. This only adds to the strange things happening here. The encounters with the man somehow made me feel safe. Interesting. Some paranormal stuff. Ooh. That looks interesting. And draw map. Yes. Let's go. We got a map. I like the map. That's pretty cool. Okay, wait, hold on. Can I put it away? Is there anything else that I really need? So there seems to be... Oh, so... It's interesting. I wonder how I got here. Like, what caused me to get here? Oh. Hold on. Um... Oh, this guy, that's serious. I was thinking I've won this game so far. Wait, what just happened? Wait, where was he? That was genuinely weird. Okay, what's this sense? So we're adding, looking for those two pieces. We're just gonna ignore that. That didn't happen. It's fine. You know, he was obviously taken care of. Looked a little strange. 
Stop getting tired. Okay, we gotta save our progress. Saved. You start getting tired again. And your soul lights prevent you. Okay, so we're getting tired, but we already slept. Wait, we've already... Hold on. Wait. We've been here before. How did we not see the village? This is very confusing. So that's where it was the whole time. Okay, we're supposed to be following this. Feels like it. You know what this kind of reminds me of? It reminds me of the Wisps from Brave. Map updated. Okay. We kind of did. Staying near soul lights prevents you from getting tired of lighting it. Uh, let's you save here. You came. Yippee. My name is Elizabeth. The old man who lived here never played with me. May you play? Let's go hide and seek. I hide first. You find me. This is like a legitimate demo for a game that I'm actually now pretty excited about. I really hope they fully release this game, and I hope they do it rather... Well, they just released it today! <laughs> I'm not gonna rush them, but it seems like... You know, they're obviously probably working on it. Okay, I think I... Is that it right there? Not hiding very well. Yeah, it's right there. So these are the save areas. We didn't find a proper hiding place yet. I want to go again. Okay. Okay. This way. Something's gonna pop out at me. I just know it. That thing is always unnerving. Uh, it's kind of disturbing. Wait, kind of went up here, didn't it? Or am I going crazy? The way to get up here. Oh, no, there's an invisible wall. I see that. Well played. Uh, there does seem that there will be, like, a section over here. Uh, just by everything I see. But it seems like it's down this path. Wisp. Where are you? That's what I'm gonna call it now. It's a wisp. Probably does have a canonical name for it, but... Oh gosh, it's gonna be up here, isn't it? Yes, I've been here. Didn't realize I wasn't supposed to be here like this. How's it going? Wait, a fresco you have a new... Interesting. So are we a soul now? Okay. Where is it? We're here. I swear, if it hit up here... 
Nope. Hey, we don't have the lighter anymore. That's pretty interesting. Oh. That's because I wasn't holding it. I forgot I could put it away. Oh, if it's up here. Is it? This is leading us back this way. You know what? I'm gonna redeem myself. I'm gonna try to climb up here because I know it's probably up there. And there's that thing again. stuck in a loop now, so... It seems like maybe that it wants us to die eventually. So it can show us those mechanics. Um, I don't know, maybe we're not really supposed to die? We'll see. Wait, what's this? The shell maintenance. The shell has a malfunctioning step that should be fixed ASAP. At its current state, it's both difficult and unnecessarily dangerous to get up. Other than that everything seems to be in order, to be honest, there is no new findings regarding the shell since the shake. But there has been some shake, so basically, like, there's been some earthquakes, actually. There's malfunctioning. That's interesting. Also, this right here is also up there. Okay, and that acts as the step. Somehow we're supposed to already be able to get up. Nah, we're not gonna get up there. So that allowed us to get higher up. I just gotta be brave. It's gotta be brave. Okay, so is that thing that we have to basically do this? Part four? We did do it. Pretty cool. It's definitely up here, though. There it is. Okay. Well, you surely took your time. Even the fisherman's dog found me faster. Okay. Well, it had a map, okay? So, like, it had a reason to be here faster. Don't you think this rock is a bit weird? It's a maintenance. It is, like, a scientific thing, so, like... Just, uh, map updated. So we go down here. I remember hoping so bad that there would be someone inside the shell. I would be in trouble for being somewhere I clearly shouldn't be. But at least I wouldn't be alone. It's true. Doubt anybody's here, though. Don't think this is gonna end well have a feeling. I'm just marveling at the production of this, because for a demo, you know, obviously there has been some great indie projects, but it's strange for a game just to appear. 
but to be this interesting. Like, this is an interesting concept. And, you know, it's something that I don't think is really super, like, generic. You know, like, I don't really see a whole lot of horror games take the time to craft the story for the demo. Okay, we know what the we know what the code is. Cancel, it's four four nine nine. That we got someone here. Oh. Four. We'll sleep right here. Good idea. Item 4658, the levitating cube. In the center of the cave is a cube made of an unknown material, probably the same metal that seems to be floating in the air. There is no an electrical field of some kind surrounding it. When we started measuring it three weeks ago, the pulsating force was initiating once every 63 seconds. For a couple of days, the interval stayed consistent. But after that, and this slowly ha has been happening more and more, at the, the time of the writing this, the pulse interval is 55 seconds. And look how this is now, that's that's crazy. The electrical force around the cube has not changed, but it remains impossible to penetrate. The force destroys every instrument we, uh, too close. The guard even tried to shoot it, but we were unable to determine from slow motion video capture that the bullet vaporized before contact. Sorry, with the rock, we believe there is something inside the cube. Okay, interesting. like the end game must remain closed okay we have to get through here oh gosh that instantly killed us we gotta be fast Clearly, simply dying was no escape. They're gonna lead us all the way back to town? No. Okay, that's good. This is pretty interesting. So, what are we supposed to do here? Is there a way to get, like, or something? Oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh no, we, we forgot to, uh, we were supposed to call it back. Obviously, I'm pretty sure if we picked anything else, we'll clutch out, but I am a bit curious. What would happen? Okay, we gotta grab this. Come back up. Wait, I just realized this pole's just standing right here. Feels a bit strange. Yeah, I see how it goes. A bit finicky, but you know, you build your flying, your 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 contraptions for your elevator the way you want. I guess that's fine with me. I like this though. This is really cool. Got some unique concepts to it, and I think that it could work out pretty well for them. Um, you know, as long as you know it's just making the game longer. Obviously, it's it almost feels like a full cool game. Now for for a indie game, so the fact that they're wanting to make it longer is awesome. There's no key card. There must be a key card I can find. Do I find anything in my inventory? Glowing rock, a small piece of glowing material provides very little light, but it's 
Better than nothing if it's quiet around. Oh. That's health. Okay. Serpent's trial unused. Okay. Once I'm in this area, gotta run. Oh crap, that is the wrong way. Oh crap. Oh dear. quite yet. Oh, there's something right here. There's no suitable key in the inventory. I need to find it. How do I find that, though? I'm not sure who did it, what, but somehow I think two people got caught, got caught in the rock blast. There was nothing left to identify with them, just blood everywhere. I don't know if the rock did something unusual or was some equipment in this place, but our traverse device was destroyed in the blast as well, so we have no way of getting home or contacting base. We're traveling to the, this dimension and back so many times that it's starting to feel ordinary. I forgot how groundbreaking technology we had and how impossible it is to replace without help from outside. There's no food. The water in the shell tastes like rust. I can hear the creature every time I close my eyes. I don't think I'll. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> oh, that's sad. Last message. That's pretty interesting. Wait, what? Why is it blinding me? Okay, what do I need to get to? That la. Oh, I need to get up there. So basically, I want to finish this. I want to just leave it. I want to actually finish the demo. Waste too much time. a bit knowing that the elevator doesn't just immediately reset, but I do understand. Alright, there we go. I didn't mean for this to be an hour long, but you know what? This demo is a lot longer than I thought it would be. Which is actually pretty cool. There's actually some pretty unique concepts. Although most of this has just kind of been spent getting used to everything. But I need to get to that platform up in there, get the key card. So I just need to go back and forth basically without getting in the blast. I don't know if there's something I need to protect me, um, but if there is, I have not. So I'm just gonna have to use my items, which I wonder I use. Okay, I can eat it with this. What is my health like? So I just need to run basically. Probably will be. How close to, can I get to? Okay, so it's right here. 
Oof, you can see the bay bones. We have to get all the way up there. We're gonna get hit once. Oh, got hit. Okay. Okay, wait. We're right here. Take that. So we got the card. Okay, we need to heal up. Take this, eat it. And... So we don't have any other food items. We didn't really think about that. Wait. We should have enough to finish everything. Oh. I'm gonna get hit once. Oh crap, it killed us. Well, we got the card though. We're good. We're good. Okay, so we got the card though. Uh, that should be saved. Uh, so we basically just need to hammer this out. Generally, I think this is pretty structured. Structured pretty well, and the environment's actually pretty cool. I didn't really mean for that to happen. But do we actually? Did we actually? Uh, Okay, we don't we already used it. We don't have very much health. That's okay. Half of them. Oh wait, we turned the two missing kind of into stone, so that's gonna give us that to go back and then unlock that. That's probably gonna be the end of the demo then. Okay, so we have a little bit more to do. Can we use the stone? Doesn't have any some protection spells. Unfortunately, we don't have any. I hope this game is played more. Um, I think it was like... I, mean, I didn't see any reviews on it, but it had just released. So it's like... I mean... You can't base it off of that. Use it. Okay, hold on. Let me read it. The matter has become unstable. We can no longer work on it. So we got that. Important. Is there a number we can call? What number? What? Hello? It's been a week now since your last contact. It's becoming dauntingly clear that something has gone wrong. We are working under the assumption that you are still alive and well, and rest assured that we are doing all we can here to get you out of there as soon as possible. Please, whatever you do, do not leave the shell. Do not leave the shell. This kind of reminds me of Lost. We might only be able to activate the connection for a brief moment. It's immensely important that you stay nearby. We hope to see you also. Stay strong. I like voice acting and everything in here. It's really cool. I like games that take the effort to be able to like tell stories. And not everyone can. Some people are just working on, you know, developing the game, which is fine and the concepts. But generally, I think that it's nice, you know, if you can put this level of like effort into it. Are you kidding me? Okay, that's fine. We almost had it. You're so close. I think we'll get the two stones. Because I think that's everything on the map for right now. Let's fall down. Nope, 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 nope. It's quicker. Whatever. I'm really excited for the full release of this, though. If it does, you know, a lot of indie games, once they encounter problems, you know, it just becomes too much. Eventually, gets to the point where they just don't. They want to work on something else, you know, something a little bit more manageable. But I honestly think, just with this level of production, they've been working on this for a little bit. 
and it seems to be panning out, so I really hope they get the support they need. Uh, so please, anybody watching this, please go download the game, play it for yourself. There seems to be a lot of interesting, like, paths and stuff, and obviously it's going to be a little bit more attractive once the actual game comes out, but, you know, I just think that, like, it deserves to be played. Just give the developers the feedback they need. You know, there obviously is some buttoniness that I've acquired just with the general polish. It'll be polished out, though. But it's like, I can't really judge it based on that. No, 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 you're kidding me, I... Wait, how am I supposed to do this? For real. Is there any food around? Oh, it's the fact that I... that I did that, so I immediately just... lost. I don't have any food or anything around. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's not gonna end well for me. Eh. I've kind of screwed myself over anyways. Oh, I'm not dead yet. Very low on health, though. There's no way I can actually make it. Might as well just try then. Oh, wait, I can sleep. I can restore my health. I think that does restore your health. Does it? Yes, it does. Can I sleep again and restore it all the way? I can't. That's fine. Are you kidding me? That is not cool. It didn't need to do that. In the world is this? Oh no. Oh no, this isn't going to be good. Wait. What? I should have it in my inventory. Oh, I don't. No, are you kidding me? I did, it took it out of my inventory. So annoying. I'm going to die. Look how slow I'm going. Well, I didn't realize it was going to take it out of my inventory, but that's fine. We're good. We're good, guys. We got it. We can finish this. I have not finished anything in my entire life. I've just been sitting here doing nothing for my entire life. It is time. I don't care how far it goes. What? Well, that didn't give me damage, but... I think I just died so many times, it's like, oh, bro, you gotta, you're fine. Am I invincible now? Honestly, I need to get one of those hacker things where I can hack games, uh, so I can, like, just generally, like, see some of the cool stuff that, like, you know, happens in development, you know, a little bit of a uh, background. It isn't necessarily to cheat actually in the game, but it's more just to afterwards when I finish the games. But, you know, people did that for like publicly done and stuff. I have a feeling we're gonna get chased, because that thing, I didn't see it originally, but yeah, that thing looks creepy. I guarantee you that's gonna come alive whenever we... We're gonna have to escape from it. That's gonna be fun. I have to have enough life for that. I guarantee you. I hope... It looks like it could be a really cool cutscene for that, uh, so I guarantee you it probably will be. Alright, let me sleep. It should bring me up to full. Sleep for a little bit. Then we have to... Okay, I didn't realize... Where's the other thing? Where is the thing?
it's been a week now since your last contact. It's becoming dauntingly clear that something has gone Wait. wrong. One oxygen cancer is uncounted for most likely due to someone failing to report well. when changing the chemistry. It's sure not that hard, people. Use the list. Okay. Please, whatever you do, do not leave the shell. It, where's the thing? I found it. Um. Photo album. I don't have it in my inventory, but it was over here originally. But now. It is quite gone. Question is, where did it go? Did it disappear forever? Don't tell me I'm soft locked. Wait. Must be something here. There's something else that I'm missing. That one does what's my own thing? Like a thing. Well, Oh wait, is there something down there? Let's see. Wait, that didn't hurt me. That one did though. Okay, I don't know if I'm soft locked or not. I really hope not, because it doesn't seem like... Gosh darn it, I want to finish this game. Down the proper way. Pretty cool. I like the menu. Did we actually use it in the thing? I'm not sure. find it all of a day. The thing isn't in here anymore, so it didn't reset. sleep real quick. Get some extra health. Then I guess we'll just go ahead and go for the other section. There's really anything else we can really do. Come on, come on. We're not gonna... Yeah. Wait. 
No, you can't do that to me. I literally passed it. Ah! No! We're gonna end it there. I know the ending's probably really cool. Just knowing this, it probably ends with a really cool chase. <sighs> we are not going to be able to see it, though, because I can't figure it out, but that's all right. Thank you guys so much for joining. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys next time.